Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obito Potato, and here we check out the latest and the greatest strategy games each and every day of the week. Today we're checking out Sons of Valhalla. Uh, this is a base building sort of style game where you have to fight your way through to the enemy. It's also kind of an upgrade sort of style game. Um, anyway, let's jump into things and see what we have got in store. I am going to be uh, playing on this save file. We're going to be playing through the campaign mode, although I'm going to be skipping through pretty much all of the dialogue because as ever, I want to get right into the gameplay um, and start speaking about the game. Anyway, uh, the premise is basically uh, we are a sailor. Uh, we die and then we get sent up to Asgard and um, this is kind of this scene right here. Um, so we go, we wake up, and who is sitting there? It's Odin. Fantastic. Um, he is, uh, he's the big man. I'm going to skip through all of this dialogue. He basically sends us back. We need to try and save our wife. That's the premise. Uh, if you want to watch the, the, the cutscenes or play the story, uh, check out the game. You should absolutely check out the game. Very, very interesting. Anyway, um, very, very sort of unique mechanic in this game i say unique mechanic you can collect these sort of runes uh, and you can attach them onto your belt so for example there's a uh, a rune here uh, wood production plus 10 percent all lumberjacks will produce more wood indeed so uh, what we can do is we can have a little uh, look on our belt and we can equip the rune uh, we can equip the rune onto we can equip the rune onto our uh, onto our belt which is which is kind of cool now uh which there we go. Uh, this is that's it. R. It's R. That's the button that we can uh, we can have a little look. So yeah, there's a whole bunch of different um, whole bunch of different whole bunch of different sort of categories. We've got melee. We've got range. Uh, we've got armor. We've got home and base building improvements. And then I think we've also got like religious or whatever whatever that category is. Anyway, the point is that we can have up to three runes in each category, uh, and we can also spend a rune token of which we have one to unlock a brand new slot in any given category, and it becomes progressively more expensive, I believe, uh, in order to uh, in order to unlock those slots. Anyway, let's go through the Bifrost right here, and let us return to Earth where our mission will hopefully become clear. Okay, so this is the interface that we're going to be uh, experiencing most of the time. Uh, we can interact with uh, uh, a couple of different things in the world. There's This is a crate, for example, and look at that. We've got another, uh, another rune. A refreshing thrust. Performing a double attack will be able to refill your stamina. Okay, that seems pretty cool. Let's get that added. I mean, we've got slots available, so that's, uh, that's pretty darned great. Okay, um, we've got this champ here. Uh, we've got our little uh, our little base, um, and we are going to start building. So first things first, what do we got going on? Well, we've got all of our uh, all of our resources up at the top here. Uh, we've got our currency. Uh, we've got some wood. We've got fish, and we have our people or our uh, our army, so to speak. And our army is going to be arriving on this big old gorgeous longboat here. Um, and they should be. Oh, look! There we go. They're giving us uh, giving us some more uh, some more stuff. Anyway, they've um, they've dropped the people off. You can't see it, but they uh, they have. Uh, we have got we've got a couple of different slots that we are able to uh, to build bases. Oh, look! There there we go. Our people are there. Uh, we got a couple of different slots that we can that we can build stuff in. Uh, first things first, uh, we're probably going to be building a fishing hut in this specific location. Uh, this is what's recommended. We're just going to go with it for now, although we can build uh, a couple of different things. Uh, we'll build a fishing hut for now, which is perfect. And we will also build, uh, we will build a barracks right here. The fishing hut is going to give us more food and the barracks is going to give us more soldiers. Uh, so there we go. Anyway, uh, the the uh, the enemy have decided to attack. I can assist the enemy. Uh, there we go. Fantastic. Beautiful. And what have we got here? Focus strike. Performing a light attack will do critical damage. Uh, very, very nice indeed. Uh, we will add that. Uh, we will add that. So uh, we've got a gate here, which is basically just you know, a, a thingy that will uh, that will defend us. Uh, we've got our troops. The the interesting thing about this game is that we can Hold position. Um, we can give our troops instructions, so we can get them to follow, attack, etc. I'm going to get them to hold position. Uh, the other cool thing is is the shield wall, which uh, which I particularly like. Uh, let's just leave this as uh, as hold position for now, uh, whilst we sort of assess what else is going on. Yeah, uh, we also have a few bits of uh, equipment that we carry on our person at all times. Uh, this is meat, and this is mead. Uh, meat will allow us to replenish our HP, which is here, and mead will allow us to replenish our stamina uh, after we after we do 
after we do attacks. There we go. Boom. And then we can drink. There we go. Mead, etc. Uh, I'm going to make sure that I'm restocked so I've got 100% of everything, which is pretty darn good. Okay. Uh, fishing hut. We can get some uh, We can get some upgrades to the fishing hut. Uh, the mead hole upgrade is required. Yep, we're going to do that. Uh, we can also repair it if we need to. Uh, clearly, what I need to look at doing first is an upgrade to the meat hole. We need 1,450 coins and 75 wood. That is okay. Uh, we can also get some personal modifiers, increase my stamina, increase the number of thingies, uh, meat bags that I can carry. I think that's amber. I think that's the uh, the, the resource that, uh, that we have up here. Uh, barracks, we can also get some upgrade to the barracks, which will allow us to uh, to improve the quality of our uh, of our of our troops. Uh, which I am very interested in doing. For now, though, I think we should have a little explore. So obviously, along the bottom of the, along the bottom of the screen here, we've got a little map that shows us exactly what's happening. So this is an enemy outpost. Enemy outpost, enemy outpost, big bad enemy at the end there. Uh, we have got uh, a little enemy outpost over here. Let's uh, attack. There we go. I'm quite happy to I'm quite happy to fight on the front lines as well. So we should be able to get additional resources, which is great. Uh, let's get the follow me, follow me, follow me melee, uh, and let's lead them into attack. let's lead them back a little bit, and then let's uh, let's go and attack again. Fantastic, beautiful. I did a I did a. There's different types of strikes that you can do. We can do regular light attacks. We can do heavy attacks, and that can be initiated when the uh, when the thingy flashes, which is brilliant. I uh, don't particularly want to take damage, but I'm going to say, follow me melee, come back a little bit, and hold position right here. I'm going to retreat. I'm going to drink a little bit of, or eat a little bit of food. Uh, we also have the ability to uh, fire arrows. Uh, I can only carry, I think it's up to, is it three arrows at a time? Yeah, I'm out of arrows. I'm out of arrows, but that's not necessarily a problem. Right, let's go attack. We need to uh, we need to be attacking. I can also block, uh, which is kind of nice. And I think I'm inclined to block the uh, the attacks here. Oh, that's the wrong way to block. There we go. Um, I don't particularly want to take about a million years for my. Can I fire over the top here? No way that hits. Now, yeah, you know what? Just just chill there. Just chill there. I'm gonna retreat a little bit and grab um and grab some more uh, some more food, uh, and heal up, which is quite nice. There we go. And I will get myself back into back into the fray. We do have the resources to upgrade my uh, my meat hole now, which in fact I might do. Uh, here we go. Block, block. Get absolutely dunked on, you uh, you nerd. Fantastic. Uh, that is a battering ram. That is a siege ram. I am not particularly enthusiastic about this. Uh, let's get... Uh, follow me. Follow me. Everybody run back. Everybody run back. Everybody run back. And... Stay here. And we'll get everybody to hold position. Position. Hold position right here, please. Thank you very much. Uh, no, I didn't. I didn't say follow. Follow me. I said hold position. Hold position. There we go. And we want to attack. Nice. Okay, so that is going to destroy the gate slowly but surely. But honestly, I'm not really anticipating too much difficulty. Yeah, I know. I'm. I know. I'm dealing with the attack right now. Fantastic. Okay. I'm completely out of stamina. Let's uh, drink up. Beautiful. Okay. So that's looking pretty good. Uh, we can repair the gate, which in fact I think I'm going to do just sort of straight up, which is pretty nice. Uh, what else do we need to get done? I need to restock my equipment, that's for sure. I need to enter the meat hall. I need to get it upgraded. Uh, crucially, this is going to give us from 5 to 10 units, which is which is really, really nice. Uh, but more importantly than that, it's going to give us Remember access to, to additional building, building sites. There we go. Thank you very much. Anyway, Meat Hole is getting, is getting, 
is getting bumped up. Let's have a little look here. Uh, we can get a woodcutter hut or we can get another fishing hut. Uh, what I really want to get here is I'd really like to get an archery range there. But I think we've got to the other side of the... Uh, the other side here, which is probably the most efficient place to build a woodcutter's hut. And in fact, do I want to even get an upgrade here? Probably do. We're going to need a heck of a lot of wood in order to get this uh, in order to get this area up and running. We don't need to worry about sort of um, you know workers or manpower or anything like that. Uh, we just kind of have to deal with things as it is. Uh, a few more resources that have been dropped off here, which is quite nice. Um, I am going to train additional swordsmen. We definitely need to do this. This is very, 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 very important part of the uh, of the process. Uh, I think we're going to set up how many? Five. Five seems pretty good. I think that seems that seems really decent. Don't worry. I'm. I need. In fact, I prefer using ranged weapons in um in in games. Oh, we're gonna pet the dog as well. There we go. Happy dog. Fantastic. Uh, right, what do we need in order to get archers? What do we need in order to get archers? I really want to see if I can try and beef up my archers as much as I possibly can. So that's going to be a priority for us, I think, going forward. I can probably nab a few of these. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a lot of additional wood by the looks of things. Wood seems to be the resource that we are requiring at the moment in the largest quantity. So let's look at an upgrade. What do we need? 300 resources or 300, um, 300 coins and 100, 100 wood. How likely is it that I get that in any sort of decent time frame? It's not crazy. I think maybe if we go on one, uh, one additional sort of expedition, we've got one swordsman to train up. We go on an additional expedition, we're going to be able to get, we're going to be able to get more wood. We've got nine, nine soldiers here, four, uh, four archers in the tower. That's not too bad. Two more of these. Excellent. Very nice. Uh, we're taking a little bit of fire, but frankly, that is of absolutely no concern to me because I've now got an even better gate. Uh, and in fact, um, your units can enter at any time. That is, that's brilliant. Uh, we can increase slash decrease the number of units that we've got. I think we're, we're probably going to take all of the units off, um, off duty whilst we go and attack, right? Okay, is that all of my units trained up? Sure yep. Use your double attack. Don't worry, don't worry. I'll use my double attack, buddy. Okay. Uh, yeah. Train up a few more of these guys. I know that I, I I'm saying I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna do it, but let's, uh, let's do. Follow me. Follow me, and let us move out. Attack. Beautiful. Bad timing, guys. Double attack. Beautiful. I mean, just absolutely eliminated. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, melee fighters will be able to dodge your enemy attacks more easily. Uh, melee fighters. Oh, so this is this is a uh, this is a modifier to my entire team. Well, that's excellent because I'm going to be going into fight uh, to fight with a bunch of melee fighters in this specific instance. So that's really nice. Okay, what else have we got here? We got a barrel. We got a crate. Uh, and there is a freakishly large enemy right here. Uh, follow me. Follow me, everybody back. Everybody back, please. Everybody back. Everybody back. Everybody back. Everybody back. And we do not uh, have the capability to do a shield wall because we don't have any shield people. But that's fine. Back, 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 back. Hold position. Get into the, get into the tower. Make sure I don't die. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. I don't know why we're fighting out with our base, but we're here now. Very good job, especially from the archers there. Really, really like that. Okay, um, let's hold position right here. Hold position. hold position right here whilst I get the base upgraded again. Uh, what's the next upgrade, by the way, for the meat hall? 2,200, 475 wood. So we need, to, we need to get a few additional upgrades to the woodcutter hut because that will increase the amount that we're able to store. Very, very important and, in fact, essential in order to get that maximum cap. But we just need more wood in general, to be honest. We need another upgrade for the meat hall in order to get to the next level. That's fine. What about an upgrade to the fishing hut? We need 100 wood. I mean, we're not a million miles away. And to be honest, 100 wood is easy to come by. Uh, more importantly than that, fish is the the ingredient when we are training up uh, soldiers. So we'll we'll get that we'll get that into place. 
Uh, archery range, 350 coins. It's the coins that are... It's the coins that are really sort of tough to come by. Let's restock, and let's see if we can try and move out. Do I have the capability to train any additional units? I'll train one. Follow me. Let's move. Let's move, let's move, let's move. Okay. Beautiful. Uh, retreat a little bit. Melee attack. Okay. Oh. Uh, everybody attack. There we go. I don't know why you managed to get there into the back, but that's fine. Uh, that looks really good, whatever the heck that is. Uh, what is it? More efficient organization increases the maximum storage capacity of all your resources. That's rare. Uh, I will absolutely take that. That is sick. Uh, the gate has been rebuilt. That's fine. Okay, that is a ranged... Oh my goodness gracious me. That's a nasty, evil individual. And I am being absolutely cream crackered by that person. I'm going to retreat a little bit. Drink up. Okay. Attack with some uh, very weak... Very weak arrows. Uh, follow me. Follow me. Retreat, retreat, retreat. Retreat. And we'll turn and attack. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, can I get this tower actually, Dan? I want to kill this scarecrow creature. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I need to dodge out of here, please. Thank you. I really would rather not... I really would rather not die. I'm just going to kite him a little bit. There we go. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. We defeated the Scarecrow. Attack range for all of my units is now increased, which is great. I need to be I need to be retreating. I need to be retreating right here. Um, a very, very successful raid, if I do indeed say so myself. I'm going to restock just because I need the HP. But also, uh, I need to make sure that I can defend the walls. Very nice. There is an enemy shield, uh, but uh, there's thankfully we had one archer, which was ready to rock and roll. Uh, I did lose quite a lot of troops uh, in that instance, but that's fine. Right, what are the upgrades going to do? Uh, wow, holy cow, that's a really, really good, a really, really good upgrade. Going to have training time. I'm going to go for uh, upgrades on both of these, uh, both of these facilities. They're now going to be upgraded to the maximum level. Uh, I really would like to get attack speed, attack range, all of that sort of stuff, but I think for now we'll just have to settle for additional. Uh, additional units. Uh, we don't require wood for the swordsman, so that's completely fine. What was that upgrade worth? 2,200. Yeah, we need to we need to just attack. We need to attack this outpost. If we get the outpost, then then that'd be great. We got, we did get the, um, the scarecrow, so I think we should be I think we should be in for a little bit of a payday if I'm not mistaken. We'll go and see if we can try and get some good stuff. Right, no more archers to train. We need more coin. No more swordsmen to train. We need more. Uh, we need more coin. Follow me. Follow me, everyone. Let's go. Okay. Attack. Here we go. Attack. I'm gonna guard. I'm gonna guard my troops as best I can. Easy. Okay. Open chest. Let's see what we get. Uh, we get a rune upgrade socket, and we also have a siege weapons will gain more health. Okay. That's fine. I don't think that that's a particularly great facility, but that's okay. Uh, Archer, let's, uh, let's take you out. Beautiful. Excellent. Really, really good. And now we can just capture the, uh, capture the town, in fact, which I should be able to do relatively easily. And hopefully... There we go. We're doing it. Uh, our flag is is becoming is becoming the flag of the outpost, which is great. Well done. Very nice. We'll take We've taken our first outpost. Okay. Let's get this uh, let's get this area cleaned up, eh? What the heck is this? 
Use the altar? Whoa! Okay, so these are divine runes. Um, this rune allows you to create a powerful whirlwind attack. Okay, hold down the key and move. Okay, we'll get that added. Uh, oh, I see. It was a it was a one or t'other. Well, I guess we got a whirlwind attack now, which is which is absolutely fine. Um, yeah. What the heck was my hold down the key and move quickly from left to right several times to start the whirlwind? Oh my goodness gracious me! Well, that's pretty gnarly, I must say. Let's see if we can try and use it in combat. Oh my goodness, that is absolutely sickeningly good. Uh, I need to be very careful about using it, but it's pretty nice anyway. Uh, right, uh, breathing world. Your units automatically get more stamina in your fortresses and outposts. Okay, well, I can actually like uh, unlock this slot right here and get this added in that slot right there, which I think is the right thing to do. Uh, these guys are going to hold position, which is quite nice. Uh, as long as they do, we should be fine. Uh, we have a farm right here, which is which is kind of cool. Unlocks the ability to use a supply warehouse as an outpost. Hunter's an experienced and very fast archer. A field medic allows us to heal people or a pyromaniac. Right, well, there's quite a lot of interesting buildings there. That's cool. Uh, open fast travel. We can travel back to our original destination. Uh, enter the watchtower. Repair the watchtower. Can I repair the watchtower? Yeah, but I don't necessarily want to because it's kind of useless now unless we, of course, lose this uh, lose this position. Uh, do I have enough troops? Do I have enough resources to maybe think about an upgrade? Uh, not really. I'd like to get a few things. I'd like to get a few things first. Trade 50 food with this location. I, I, I don't need I don't need the food. I don't need the food. I need the gold really more than anything. I'd love the hunter. Uh, that's going to cost me four uh, four people slots, which is fine. Um, we can only get one mercenary at a time to use a supply warehouse in this outpost. Sure, let's do let's do that. Let's do that um, because that's going to allow us to restock right here, which is pretty great. Now, I'd like to go back to the uh, to the base and get additional resources if at all possible. Ooh, my personal stamina or replenish your stamina. I will take, I'll take just an increase in stamina, please. 120 in order to get max HP up. It's a bit more expensive. Uh, I think I want to get some archer upgrades if I can afford them. I'll do it. And I'll do a few of these guys as well. How many can we handle? We can handle up to four, which I think is fine. I think that's okay. Now, are you going to run right along to the end? I think, yeah, you're going to run back to the, the point of maximum maximum progress. And I can fast travel here. I'll travel forward. We are going to see our, our troops arrive here uh, at some point, which is, which is kind of nice. Now, can I upgrade this gate? I can repair it for hardly anything, so I'll do that. But I'm going to maybe see if I can try and maybe move along and scout out what's going on. Right. Enemy capture time plus 30. Uh, okay, well, I, I don't think that that's particularly useful because I'm not really anticipating that any enemies are going to be capturing me anytime soon. Right. So, um, we unfortunately do not have any shield units. I'm the only shield unit that we have. Remember that shield wall that I utilized at the start? Uh, I would quite like the opportunity to... Quite like the opportunity to get one of those. Uh, but I'm also kind of confident that if we do attack, we are going to lose I don't want to say a lot of I don't want to say a lot of people, but I feel like we are going to lose some people. Uh, let's maybe poke them a little bit, shall we? I'm going to re, uh, re-up my, my stock first. There we go. Honestly, come at me. Come at me. The more, the more the merrier. Right, okay. Uh, let's go follow me. And let's see if we can maybe do some attack in here. Uh, archers. Follow me. There we go. Can we do... Oh, just attack. attack. Just attack. Okay. Can I... Uh... There we go. We really, really need to do to do something about that uh, about that archer up there. There we go, fantastic. Okay, 
So you're taken out now. That's great. Which means that regardless of what happens, we'll be okay. Uh, follow me. Retreat. Retreat a little bit. Retreat a little bit. Retreat a little bit. I've got that whirlwind attack, remember? Okay, we need to... We need to retreat a little bit. We need to retreat a little bit. Okay. Hold position here. Hold position. Hold position, and we can just do... Do a little bit of cleanup. Clean up, uh, clean up, clean up, clean up. Which is quite nice. Let's move... Amazing. Amazing. Love it. Max stamina at night. I'll take it. That's fine. Okay, follow me and retreat. Follow me and retreat. Follow me and retreat. I've got the I've got the opportunity to get some upgrades, so that's really, really nice. Hold position. Hold position right here. Okay, restock. And hopefully we should be able to defend these walls with not too many issues. Uh can I do anything here? No, I need to I need to fast travel back, which I will do very, very happily indeed. Right, Mead Hall needs to be upgraded. You're doing uh, amazingly well, so I'm doing amazingly well. That's really, really nice to see. Okay, what can we build in here? We can build a blacksmith, uh, can upgrade my equipment, and there's also a siege workshop. The siege workshop, frankly, should be built at the other end of the village, uh, because... Believe it or not, it's probably going to take quite a long time for the siege uh, the siege equipment to get to where it needs to go. We also need to be thinking about any and all upgrades to all of our existing buildings, which should be fine. Are we... Yeah, we should be fine. So, uh, the catapult is 450. The ram is 100 wood. I mean, we can afford that, like, now? Now? The wood? The wood now? Right now? Right... Right now, there we go. I knew it. Okay, I can also afford an upgrade at the uh, da, 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 the mead hole. Yeah, let's take. Actually, just give me like HP upgrades. I think that's what we kind of need. Uh, HP and a stamina upgrade, or HP and a mead upgrade. You know what? We'll we'll leave it at, at that, and I'll come back for it. Uh, what did the blacksmith cost? 200 woods. Uh, I don't really want to wait around for 200 wood. Let's uh, let's fast travel back. Travel back forward. So we should see the siege engine sort of creeping along here. Oh my goodness. Good thing that I returned when I did. I mean, seriously? Don't destroy my tower? Ugh. Well... Everybody's going to be eliminated, which is which is obviously fine. Uh, let's get this gate repaired. That is a huge investment, honestly. Loot amount, enemies only. What do I care about? Wood production. Uh, I kind of rate wood production, but I can unlock I can unlock that there and then get that added in, which is fine. Uh, Watchtower needs to be repaired. Absolutely, going to get it all all up and running. Uh, let's go and see if we can try and collect the spoils of war. Hmm. Okay, I don't really want to just take unnecessary hits there. Where's my siege engine? Where's my siege engine? It should be coming. Right? It should be coming. Uh, I'm going to get this blacksmith built whilst I'm back here. 200 woods? Ugh. Okay, I'll deal with it. I'll deal, deal with that in a minute. Where's the siege engine? Did I... Did I build it? Am I going crazy? Maybe it was destroyed in the, uh, in the attack? I thought I'd... Maybe it just is taking a long time? Oh, it's just taking an absolute age to get done. Well, upgrading that is clearly a priority if, uh... If we don't want to be waiting for a bazillion years. Archers... Give me some additional archers. Sure, that's fine too. Let's get uh, let's get this upgrade, eh? Get an upgrade to our health. That sounds fine. And then let's look to go on an offensive. We, we don't have to wait for necessarily both siege engines, but I need at least one siege engine. It seems only prudent. And the ram honestly seems like the 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 preferable the preferable bit of kit, I think. Is that us at max capacity? I think we're at max capacity with one more. Okay, so once we get uh, once we get all of these these things built, we we should be 
it's gonna take it's gonna take such a flipping long time for my uh, for my siege engine to arrive on the front line, isn't it? Is there anything that I can get with some any upgrades that I can get with the fishes? Archer hit points. Uh, I can get attacks. I can get I can get an upgrade here. Production time for for these guys. Uh, oh yeah, I need to check out the uh, the blacksmith. That's the woodcutter's house. Oh yeah, I haven't built the blacksmith yet. Okay, I will return to the front line in just a second. Don't you worry, video game. I will return. Right, we can't get an upgrade. That is the maximum level of our of our mead hall. The blacksmith, what do we got? Increases it is is this my attack speed. Okay, I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. What the heck? I'm I'm feeling I'm feeling good. Okay. Let's move over to here and let's say follow me. Follow me. Beautiful. I think we've only got one archer. The siege engine is moving forward. I think that's it right there on the little minimap. Just fine. Yep. Okay. This is looking good. We're we're ready. Let's get um Let's get this. Oh my goodness, I can move the I can move the ram. Very nice. Okay, I think we're ready to I think we're ready to attack. Follow me, everyone. What about the ram? Is the ram coming with me? Follow me. There we go. Okay, the ram is coming. It's just gonna take a little bit of time. <laughs> it's gonna take a little bit of time to get absolutely anywhere. Some pretty decent shooting if I do indeed say so myself. Okay. I missed you, unfortunately. Okay, Archer, you're doing a grand old job. I'm going to defend my troops here. There we go. Ah! Okay, we got the archers out, uh, so that's good. Max health plus 10%. I might, I might take that. Uh, we're in the middle of a siege though, so... Honestly, as long as I'm helping, uh, loot up by 20%. Uh, that's pretty decent in the fact that we have loot amount uh, plus 10% at the moment. I can't upgrade that, so I think we're just going to switch it out for now, which I'm, uh, which I'm happy to do. Max health? Do I want to take the max health bonus? I don't think I do, actually. I'm going to retreat a little bit. Drink up. There we go. Nice. Don't kill me, please. I do not have any stamina. Drink. Drink. Okay. Nice! We're through! Fantastic. Great job, everyone. Great job. Truly great job. Right, capture time uh, is is fine. Let's get this chest opened. Open barrel, open barrel. Get that all opened. Get that destroyed. I don't know what I'm destroying, but I'm going to capture something, I hope. It's right here. Okay, this is where we need to capture. Let's get this captured and let's get this captured fast. Oh, that is, that is quite the... Uh, that is quite the siege there. Holy cow. We actually lost nobody? Okay, let's get restocked so that we stop this uh, flashing on screen. Oh, your fighters seem to be too weak. I'm work I'm working on it. Jeez Louise. Anyway, um from here, what is this? Okay, we, we can uh, we can get some we can get some upgrades to we can get some upgrades to this meat hole, right? Yeah, we can upgrade this meat hole if we want to. Do I want to do that? I mean, I'm not necessarily sure that I do. Uh, increase my max health. I'll take an increase to my max health. That is absolutely fine. Uh, what was this? Uh, enemy stamina minus two, 10% chance. I don't particularly need to worry about that. Oh, look, my catapult has actually finally arrived. Very cool. Right. Uh, we can train additional fighters. It is honestly probable that I want to get a archery uh, range here. Let's do it. We can also fast travel back to... Right back to the base. And we can get some upgrades here. Train archers. I don't want to train any archers, but I will take that. I will take that. I will take that. 
I love me some archers. So I don't know if these upgrades apply... I don't know if these upgrades apply uh, to everybody trained at just that barracks, or if it's just the, uh, or if it's just archers in general. Looks like it's archers in general, which is which is amazing. Uh, I would love to upgrade this facility right here. Meat hole upgrade required. Oh, we need to upgrade this specific meat hole. Well, I'm not gonna be able to do that, which is a little bit of a shame, but that's fine. Uh, it's only training time though that that it reduces. Instead, we can upgrade at the we can upgrade at the old uh, the old archers uh, old archery range if we need to. Okay. Do I need anything here? Probably want to see if we can try and grab an additional fishing hut. Because we need more We need more fish. So we'll do that. And then I think we're just gonna we're gonna go for it. We're gonna attack. Right. Follow me. Follow me. Let us go into battle where nobody has gone before. What's in this chest here? Fortress resupply plus 20. Ships will make their way across the sea faster. Um yeah, probably want to switch out the wood production. The wood production one for that. Okay, this is this seems pretty nasty. Uh, this looks like a big bad guy here. Okay, not so big anymore apparently. I need to uh I need to drink up. Here we go. Let's see if I can try and... Yeah, retreat a little bit. Uh, yeah. Kind of don't want to take this, actually. Kind of don't want to take this. Hold position right here. Yeah, I need to replenish a little bit of... Yeah, actually do that. Just, just, just do that for a second. I'm going to really quickly disappear back and restock which again is going to stop this frenetic uh frenetic flashing and then we're going to move back in okay it's just is so brutal to like endure the the arrows the arrow swarm okay let's go let's go attack 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 Okay, clearly uh, the ability to destroy those things is limited. Uh, we need to... Okay, that is... There's a nasty individual here. I'm going to retreat a little bit. Drink. 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 Eat. Oh my lordy. Holy cow, these guys are tough. Beautiful. Well done. Uh, we did it. And we get an attack range bonus as well, which is quite nice. Um, during during night. Uh, this is fine. Uh, I think we can take this, honestly. Open the chest. What do we got? Anything decent? Max stamina plus 20%. I can't actually see what's happening. No, I died. Okay, that is uh, a big sad because that means that we lose our runes. We don't lose our divine rune, I believe. Uh, we do lose, we do lose our other runes, which oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, thank you. Um, sacrifice max stamina at night. There we go. Take care of yourself, Thorodolos. Don't worry, I will take care of myself. Uh, yeah, I think, honestly, if I hadn't been caught in the crossfire there, or if I had the, uh, the stamina to hold up my shield, which, unfortunately, um, I didn't. Your... Yes, I know, I know, I know. Uh, we might still be attacking if I'm... If I'm... If I'm lucky, are we still attacking? We basically finished the enemy off, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, come on, get out of here. Okay, we are still attacking, which is good. 
Nice. Okay. Roll away. Oh, I see you're here. Yeah, so that's annoying, actually. That's not- that's my guy. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Retreat. Drink. Drink. Oh my goodness, you're going up the ladder. Uh, yeah, destroy the... Destroy that. Retreat a little bit. Yeah, there's a lot of... A lot of stuff happening here. But we have actually cleaned up, which is quite nice. Here we go. Destroy these guys with the power of ranged. Very nice. Oh! I was forced move to move forward. Oh. So tell me, what brings you to beautiful England? Save I'm seeking you my know. my wife. You kidnapped my wife and murdered your fa my you father. Know, I must confess, I don't know. Deliver. <laughs> the answer would. Wait. Oh, he's running off. He's a barbarian. He's a barbarian lord that is. Uh... I am so dead. Retreat, please. What are we do what are we doing? I am so I am so deep. I am so deep into enemy territory and we did not take that outpost. Anyway, look, that doesn't matter. I think that's a great place for us to wrap up. Uh ladies and gentlemen, thank you ever so much for watching. Uh Sons of Valhalla uh, is very, very cool. I like it a lot. I feel like we barely scratched the surface. I don't know what the heck is happening uh story-wise. Uh we're just gonna leave it here. Anyway, thank you ever so much for watching. My name, of course, has been Obito Potato. I'll catch you next time. Bye.